Yeah, Mike, when you go out for Senate confirmation, it's always nice to have sitting across from you maybe the co-chair who happens to be one of your constituents, such was the case for the secretary designate this morning. It's thrilled to be here with my friend, Congresswoman Marshall Fudge. Connie and I live in the city of Cleveland in her district. Senator Sherrod Brown helping to kick off the Senate confirmation hearing of Secretary of Housing and Urban Development designate Marsha Fudge. I have dedicated my entire life to public service and to working to help low-income families, seniors, and communities. I believe I am up to the challenge that is before me. In a show of bipartisan support, Republican Senator Rob Portman also spoke on Fudge's behalf. I don't always agree with Marsha on policy. She certainly doesn't always agree with me, but I can speak to her integrity, her commitment to justice, and the strength of her character. I think she's got a public servant's heart. The biggest obstacle for Fudge were past partisan statements made in political arguments with Republicans, in particular over President Trump's Supreme Court pick of Amy Coney Barrett last fall. I'm troubled by this and several other statements because in my mind they raise questions about your willingness and ability to work with Republicans if this is your opinion of Republicans. Fudge told the senator yes, there was more to the quotes he mentioned. That being said. Sometimes I am a little passionate about things. Is my tone pitch perfect all the time? It is not. Uh, but I do know this, that I have the ability and the capacity to work with Republicans. Uh, and I intend to do just that. And that is my commitment to you. And no vote today on the, the appointments committee members have until next Monday to gather their questions that they submitted in writing afterwards. Answer back. We will then see a vote after that. Reporting live in Shaker Heights, John Kasich, News 5.